Oxygen Reservoir. During this video, we will review the function and proper use of the oxygen reservoir. The Gradient CCV workstation comes outfitted with an oxygen reservoir to optimize use with low flow oxygen sources such as an oxygen concentrator. The reservoir works by collecting oxygen from the concentrator during exhalation for use in the next inhalation. The benefit of this process is that you are able to deliver a higher flow rate to the patient than the output flow rate of the concentrator. In short, your oxygen supply is more consistent and reliable than it would be without the reservoir. The CCV's maximum allowed oxygen consumption when using low flow oxygen sources is 10 liters per minute. With the reservoir, you can store oxygen produced by a concentrator so that you have more oxygen to use the next time they breathe in. This means a 5 liter per minute concentrator can provide a flow of up to 10 liters per minute during inhalation. The reservoir should be used whenever the oxygen source delivers less than 10 liters per minute. This includes flow meters and concentrators. It's important to remember, however, that the reservoir only stores enough oxygen for one breath. It is not a backup cylinder. Now, let's review how to connect the reservoir to the oxygen source and the CCV. First, use the reservoir hose to connect the concentrator outlet to the reservoir inlet, securing the connection with the provided hose clamps. Do not use the humidifier bottle on the concentrator if present. Instead, directly connect the outlet of the concentrator to the reservoir. Then, connect the reservoir outlet to the DISS oxygen port on the CCV's left panel. Turn the concentrator on to full flow, ensuring there are no leaks in the system, and wait for the reservoir to pressurize. The concentrator flow meter will drop to zero when the reservoir is full because there will be no flow from the concentrator to the reservoir. During normal ventilation, make sure the flow meter consistently drops down to zero during a breath cycle. This indicates that the cylinder is filling completely. During session 2, part 4, we will discuss low flow sources in more depth including the use of O2 conserve mode on the CCV.